Hey everybody, it's Dr. Steve Fleischer of Everybody's Chiropractic and Wellness here in King of Prussia, Pennsylvania. And today I want to talk to you about what may be going on in your homes that shouldn't be going on in your homes. When all this is said and done, this coronavirus is beyond us and it will be beyond us and we'll come out on the other side much better for it. Do you want to be healthier or do you want to be less healthy than when this whole thing started? I know it's easy to get out of routines when you're at home, you're not working in or out of the house like you used to, but it's really important now more than ever to try and stick to those routines. Go to bed at the same time, get up at the same time in the morning, get a shower, get dressed, do what you would normally do. Don't go away from your routine because if you do, it's not going to help you physically and it's not going to help you psychologically either. Not only that, when all this is over and we do get back to our routines, it's going to be difficult to fall back in line again. So, get yourself moving throughout the day. Get up at the same time. Now, we've got all this extra time on our hands, and we've got unbelievable technology that we never had as kids, my parents never had. Go online, download some videos, get on a training course, start taking some exercise classes, simple things that you can do at home. There are tons of them on the internet right now. Do a little research and get your body moving. It's very, very important. You also want to make sure you can take this time to maybe learn some new things. Maybe learn a language. There's a website called Duolingo that you can learn a language on there. It'll help work on your brain. You want to make sure that you're increasing your ability to learn and increasing your ability to work your body during this time. So it'll help you emotionally. It'll help you physically. Being emotionally sound and physically sound during this time will help make sure your immune system is working at its optimal levels. If you don't want to deal with any of that, something as simple as just making a plan to go up and down stairs several times throughout the day. Make a chart for yourself. Say, okay, today I'm going to do three times up and down the stairs and do that for a couple days. Then maybe you move up to four times. But you've got to do something. If you're just sitting around on the couch watching TV all the time, it's not good for your mind and it's not good for your body. If you have any questions or you're looking for some other tips, things that you can do to help keep yourself going. Oh, and one more thing, really important, get outside every single day. I know we've had a lot of rain here in Pennsylvania over the last month or two, but try and get outside even if it's raining. I promise you'll dry off. Uh, the fresh air is really good for your lungs. It's good for your mind and your body. And get outside and try and do some walking if you can. Very, very important. It helps set that mind straight. So until next time, Dr. Steve Fleischer at Everybody's Chiropractic and Wellness. Get off that couch.